column subtraction. When we can't subtract two numbers in a head, we write it down. This is the units column and this is the tens column. We subtract 3 from 7, which gives us 4 units, and 2 from 9 tens, which gives us 7 tens. And that's the answer of 74. Sometimes this method isn't as simple. For example, 91 take away 25. When I try and take away 5 from 1, I get a negative number because subtraction is not commutative. So I rename 9 tens and make it 8 tens and rename 1 unit and make it 11 units. I now have 11 units take away 5 units which is 6 units. And then I do 8 tens take away 2 tens which is 6 tens and that's my answer. Once you have learnt this method you can apply it to any calculation for example, this one with decimals. First, you put your decimal point in to make sure your place values are aligned. Then you do seven hundredths take away eight hundredths, but it becomes a negative number, so you have to look to the next column. But there's a problem. There's nothing in the tenths, so you have to look to the units, and you rename it and make it eight units and make this one 10 tenths and you rename that and make it 9 tenths and make this 17 hundredths. Now I have 17 hundredths take away 8 hundredths which is 9 hundredths. Then I do 9 tenths take away 1 tenth which is 8 tenths. That's my answer.